Hi, I'm Misha Bruger Gosman, and this is Surprise! This is my first album on Deutsche Grammophon, featuring the cabaret songs of Eric Satie, Arnold Schoenberg, and William Volcom. Please enjoy it. I'm very excited. My friend George used to say, I think cabaret is a way of expressing oneself in a more casual setting. I think that uh, there are stories to be told through cabaret that are unique to the style and perhaps little snapshots of poetry that we wouldn't normally have access to just because cabaret, the nature of it is very intimate. And uh, I think that that's what attracts me to it. She is incredibly intelligent. She has a wonderful theatrical sense. She is fully equipped musically, and she has a very good verbal sense. She is very aware of what the words are that she's singing. Uh, many singers tend to look at the words as something that they just want to put in front of their beautiful sound, and that would not be the right kind of person. As he sang for this particular stranger who was in the United States Navy. Whenever I sing that song, it depends on where I am. It depends on where I am, whether people laugh or not. Because the song isn't funny. It's not funny. It's tragic. I think it's tragic, but it's so over the top. I mean, when you listen to the orchestration, it is the orchestration of this extremely flamboyant, extremely dramatic. You know, what are opera singers if they're not like female drag queens, right? I mean, we're on stage in this huge gown, singing really high, really loud. I think it's one of those pieces that you just, it's like your, all of your career and everything you've done leads you to this song because it's about this beautiful person who just wanted to stand in her living room and, and sing. Yeah, come on in, stay. But you have to be quiet while I sing. And then, a minute after. Oh, and call me Georgia. So it was really a matter of uh, working with somebody who has both a comedic sense, she's got a wonderful comic sense of how to deal with, you know, what words do. Oh, looking at me, shouted, oh, oh. 
I think the only difficulty she will ever have will be for people to try to pin her down. And she's very hard to pin down. She can do all of those things. <laughs> Everybody has those days where they just feel like the entire world is stopping for them and screaming, Amor. And how Bill Bolcom was able to recreate that scene is, um, is amazing to me. Because every time I sing that song, I feel like a million dollars. I mean, it really makes me believe really, really makes me believe. And that, I think, is uh, not to become, you know, too deep about it, because it's just a song. But it really has changed my life. I want, whenever I sing it, I really feel like I, I, I am all-powerful woman, hear me roar. <laughs>